Today's video is gonna be on this Milwaukee headlamp. So this is a 450 lumen headlamp. Um, it has a spot and flood mode. Um, they advertise a 300, 295 foot uh, spot beam and a wide flood lamp coverage. Um, it comes with hard hat clips and it is powered by triple A's, I believe. I haven't popped this out of the package yet, so I'm not sure 100%. Um, so yeah, it has a true view uh, rather than the regular LED. And I do have two other Milwaukee flashlights. And I gotta say that the true view is a lot better than the LED. Um, it's more of like a natural light. Uh, so it has sweat absorbing microfiber strap. Um, it is water and dust resistant, the IP54 rating. It's impact resistant and chemical resistant as well. Yep, right there. It says uh, three AAA batteries and it does come with them, it says. So this does have five different settings. It has the low flood at 25 lumens, medium flood at 150 lumens, high flood at 350, and then hybrid spot and flood at 450. And then it just has the spot, which is at 350. Um, so yeah, the highest setting, it runs at two hours. Um, the 350 lumen is four hours, uh, 10 hours for the medium flood. Then the low flood setting is at 25 lumens and that runs at 26 hours. And then the spot setting is at four hours. So I'm gonna open this up out of the package and I'll, uh, I'll do some tests with it. Okay, so I got it out of the package now. It does come with four of these hard hat clips, which I won't be using. Um, yeah, but here it is. So it's got two buttons. That's the power button and then the mode button. And then this does uh, have a few different angles you can position it at. The band itself is pretty stretchy and it does have two different adjustment points. So you gotta turn it on, you got the power button. And then to cycle it through the modes, you just press the mode button. Which is pretty cool. And then shut it off, press the power button again. So I'm gonna be testing this now. I'm gonna go through each of the modes. I'm gonna shut the garage lights off so you can see how bright it is. Okay, so here it is. I'm gonna shine it at the saws over here and I'm gonna go through the modes and tell you what each of them are. So I'm gonna shut the lights off now. Okay, so here's the first one. This is the spotlight. So pretty bright. Point the camera up a little bit. All right, go to the next one, which is the spot and flood light. Okay, now we got it at, I think this one is, uh, this is the high flood, so 350 lumens. Uh, this is the medium flood, which is 150. And then this is the low flood, it's hard to tell, it's even on. Um, but this is 25 lumens and it will run at 26 hours. So then, yep. Uh, now we're back at the flood or the uh, spotlight. And then you can keep cycling through it. And then to shut it off, just press the power button and it kills it. So the way you change the batteries is really easy. So you're gonna take it, you're gonna flip this forward. And then right here, you're gonna grab this, lift it forward like that. And there's the three batteries, triple A's. It does come with them too, which is nice. And then, yep, so you're good to go. Um, yeah, so the reason I bought this is I work on cars a lot and um, I bought this mainly for like working under dashes or any other time you need two hands and it's kind of hard to hold a flashlight or position a flashlight. Um, so something like this makes it really easy because whatever you're looking at is getting lit up. So that makes it really easy. Um, but yeah, I think this is good, a uh, good investment. I got this from Home Depot. It was on uh, Black Friday 
a Black Friday deal. I got it for $30. I'll link it below. I think it is 40 normally. But yeah, I'll have a link to Home Depot's website so you can check it out. But that's gonna be it for today's video. So thanks for watching.